facial oils are definitely the underdogs in the skincare game. They are underappreciated, under... <coughs> Hello, Ruby speaking. That was the post office. <laughs> John was watching me as I was filming that and <laughs> he's genuinely worried for me now. I feel like a lot of people don't like the idea of adding oil onto their skin, which I totally get it, by the way, especially if you do have oily or combination skin. I have very dry acne prone skin, so I get a lot of congestion, a lot of blind pimples, lots of texture. The right facial oils really did hydrate my skin without creating added problems like congestion and whatnot. So for me, face oils have transformed my skin. They work so beautifully under makeup. So my skincare and my makeup game is so good right now. And I just wanted to share, share this with you. Like this was initially going to be an empties video, but 80% of the empty products that I was showing you were oils. So I was like, what the hell? Let's just talk about face oils and the ones that I love and how awesome they are. So let's get started. So this is what I consider to be like a really good all-rounder. It's the Indie Lee Squalene Facial Oil. I love Indie Lee products. What I particularly like about this formula is that it helps to even out like your skin's tone and texture. So it just goes above and beyond being a face oil that helps to hydrate the skin. I like this before makeup, so I would do my skincare. This is the last product that I would apply. I tend to put this on underneath because it stops like the fuller coverage foundations from clinging to my dry spots, which I really, really like. Again, it helps to keep my skin smooth. As somebody with like acne prone skin, I have a lot of texture, like a lot, a lot of texture. And this, I believe is worth the price point. It's empty, I love it. I ordered some more from Sephora. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. So this next oil is an oil that I like to use to prep my skin before makeup because it's super fast absorbing and it just leaves my skin looking so glowy. It is the Skinstitute Multi-Active Face Oil. This is really good for dry, dehydrated, sensitive skin types. I use this when I have dermatitis flare-ups on my eyes. And for those who know what dermatitis feels like when you put a product on that doesn't agree with your skin, it stings like a bitch. But this is really gentle, great for sensitive skin. Like I said, I use it like around like the skin around my eyes. I'm pretty sure this is only $39. And I believe it's a bargain because it has like a mashup of all of these really different, usually super expensive oils um, that just work so beautifully together. And there is calendula flower extract in this as well. And I love that ingredient for when I have flare ups because it just calms everything down. This next one is amazing. It's the Biosan Squalane Tea Tree Balancing Oil. Oh, and it's not focusing. Why? There we go. This, mm, where were you when I needed you, buddy? Like a couple of years ago. This is a facial oil that has been formulated for those who have congested skin that breaks out. You've got pimples, acne and whatnot. I don't know if you've ever tried applying like straight tea tree oil to a blemish or a mosquito bite but it literally works. It reduces the size of the mosquito bite. It's less itchy. It calms the skin down. And it does the same with breakouts and pimples. Like it reduces the size of the breakout. It decongests the skin. I think it's like a wonderful, well-formulated face, like facial oil that is, you know, targeted to those who have tricky congested skin. It gets absorbed very quickly um, and it doesn't leave like a yucky, heavy, residue behind on the skin. It's not available in Australia just yet, but you can pick it up in the US and wherever else Biosance is sold. I'm pretty sure it will be available soon, um, but I just wanted to give you a heads up about this oil when it does come to Australia because it is absolutely amazing. Oh my God, I'm so spacey today. What the hell? Ugh. Okay, so I featured this oil in a video that went semi-viral and a few people lost their minds because it was just that amazing. Um, this is the Cora's Wild Rose Oil. 
It does all of the things that you would expect an oil to do in terms of like moisturizing your skin and la 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 la. But the way that it picks up the complexion and makes it look really like youthful and just beautiful, it is an, it's a really outstanding face oil. A lot of people don't really know about this brand. Get it at Mecca. They do have really nice products and this one is my favorite. It speaks to me and it smells freaking amazing and it's like super fast absorbing this oil i find is rich so you might want to take it easy like two three drops is all you all you need so i have another indie lee oil because i just love her products it is the daily vitamin infusion oil if anybody could give me any tips on how i can get the last drops of oil out of this bottle i will love you forever and ever and now that the weather is warming up and I'm swimming a lot more, I'm in chlorinated water, I'm in salt water, my skin gets really, really dry and it just needs like a little something extra because chlorine like dries the crap out of your skin. This really good at repairing the skin. This is, I'm talking about intense hydration. It is such a beautiful, beautiful oil that I particularly like to use at night. I would definitely recommend this formula over the squalene oil that I showed you from Indie Lee for more sensitive skin types. Because when I swim and like for multiple days in a row, when I do head to the pool and swim, my skin gets quite sensitive. And I like this one before I go to bed. It's just amazing. I, again, adore Indie Lee and her face oils are incredible. Okay, okay. This one is what I consider to be the Rolls Royce of facial oils. This is the Uma Absolute Anti-Aging face oil. This smells so incredible. This is an experience in itself, first of all. Um, I don't know if you guys know a lot about Uma Oils or Uma Estate. Uma is like a family-owned brand that has supplied other global brands with their oils. And I think they're based out of India, but don't quote me on that. I could be wrong. They have the most beautiful face oils and body oils that I have ever seen and felt and just experienced it is a class of its own I have to say these oils get pretty expensive but they really do deliver in the sense of you do see a difference to the appearance of your skin when it comes to like the elasticity of your skin I feel like when I use this I do notice that my skin is kind of a little bit more and I definitely notice a difference when I don't use this oil. So it is amazing. It is very, very expensive. The way that I like to use this oil is at night. I like to use a lot of my anti-aging products at night. That's kind of when your skin is repairing itself. And the scent of this oil is just magic. It takes you away to this faraway place where you feel so relaxed and at ease. I like to just drop three to four drops of oil in the palm of my hands. I warm up the oil in between my hands and the heat releases this beautiful scent. And then I pat the oil onto my skin, the skin on my face, the skin on my neck, on my shoulders and my decollete area. And I'm so relaxed and ready for bed. My skin is hydrated and quenched. It just gives you like a really, really lovely experience. Finally, I have another Biosense oil. This is the Squalene Vitamin C Rose Oil. Smells absolutely divine and I would recommend this oil to somebody who wants to brighten their complexion and is also concerned about premature aging. It is really good at helping firm the skin, address issues with elasticity once again, keeping your skin super hydrated and quenched. It really does give the skin a brightening effect. There is sugarcane derived squalane in this formulation, so it does easily absorb into the skin. And again, it's like one of those oils that can be used both AM and PM. But I really, really like it under makeup. It is so beautiful under makeup and the scent is just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Biosense has a way of creating oils that really do hydrate the skin, but they feel really light and fresh on the skin. And this is another one that you definitely have to check out. It's like a really subtle, modern, very tasteful rose scent. Very delicate, it's not overpowering. 
It's just really, really beautiful to use. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If there is an oil that you absolutely love, please let me know down below. I would love to know what it is, how it works, how you use it. So please let me know in the comment section down below. I typically upload a lot more content on Instagram, especially in the form of IGTV videos. So if you'd like to see more from me, then definitely head over to my Instagram at Ruby Galani. I will leave my handle up on the screen and also in the description box so you can find me. I look forward to chatting to you guys really soon. In the meantime, I'm going to be giving these two face oils a go because they have just landed in my office. This one is by GoTo Beauty. This one is by Cora Organics. But if you do see them in action, it will definitely be on Instagram and on IGTV.